everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome my name is Demetra today I am going to be reviewing the new Shiseido Rouge Rouge lipsticks if you want to find out what these lipsticks are like and if they're worth the splurge make sure you keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos because seriously why would you want to Shiseido recently came out with a new line of lipsticks called the Rouge Rouge lipsticks there are 16 shades in this range and as the name suggests they are all of the red variety. These lipsticks are absolutely gorgeous in terms of their packaging. They come in a beautiful little black case here. It is plastic but what I love is the magnetic closure and it just slips tight. I love it. That's actually one of my biggest complaints with Tom Ford. The lipstick is $75, but the lid does not stay on properly. So oftentimes, if it just gets thrown into my makeup bag or in my purse, the lid goes one way, the lipstick goes the other, and I'm always afraid that my product is going to break and I would just flush $75 down the toilet. But we're not talking about Tom Ford. We're talking about Shiseido. And this magnetic closure is so dope. I purchased four of the 16 shades and I am so in love with the colors that I picked. My favorite one is Bloodstone and that's the one that I'm going to talk about first um, just because it is the perfect sort of dark red um, but it's not so dark that it looks almost like blood on your lips. It is a very nice sort of I don't know how to describe it. It's like a brick red, but not exactly. It's got a darker hue to it. And this is the one that I am just going to apply to my lips. Why? Because I still need lipstick to complete my look right now. Um, you'll probably recognize this from a couple of other videos because I am doing a bunch of pre-filming because I'm leaving for Asia for a two-week work trip um, on Tuesday and I won't have time to film while I'm overseas and edit. So I'm trying to get as much done as possible today. So here we go. I am going to go ahead and apply this lipstick and I just turned on my little vanity mirror here. So let's do this. Isn't that beautiful? I really hope you can see why I love the color of this lipstick. I think it looks amazing with or without any makeup. You can just throw this on, maybe a little bit of mascara and you will look glam guaranteed. I promise. Demetra stamp of approval. I have been playing around with these lipsticks for about two months now and one thing that I've noticed about the formula is how comfortable it is to wear. Once you apply it to your lips, you sort of forget about it and it doesn't feel like you really have anything on. All of the shades that I have, and I believe that are in the rest of the range, do have a beautiful satin finish, so you are not going to have any crazy matte lipsticks that will be dehydrating. These leave a beautiful color behind, and even when they start to fade, they fade very naturally, and it doesn't look patchy, which is something else I love, love, love about this formula, of course, in addition to being hydrating. These lipsticks do retail for 33 Canadian dollars, which is a a little bit up there in price but I think they are definitely worth it. They're probably on par with the NARS Audacious lipstick. They also tend to fade a little bit better. I find with the NARS Audacious lipsticks that when they do fade, they fade a little bit patchy. Let's dive into some of these swatches so you can take a look at some of the colors that I bought.
colors are truly stunning. I have all of them swatched on the back of my hand right now. What I love about each of them is that they have their own different shade and tone. So while they're all part of the red family, they all have really nice variations to them and I think they are universal. These are gonna look great on darker skin tones, medium skin tones, and lighter ones, and even those who are super fair. I consider myself to be borderline sort of fair light, depending on the season, of course, um, and all of these colors are really popping on me, but they're not so crazy that they can't be worn on a regular basis. So these lipsticks definitely do not have to be special occasion. They are for sure everyday wear as well. You can order these lipsticks online from Sephora or you can pop into a Shoppers Drug Mart. They have those available at the Shiseido counter or you can go into any department store that has a Shiseido counter and you can pick them up from there. They are absolutely gorgeous and worth the money. I highly recommend you go and play with them, try them out, swatch some colors and figure out which ones you're going to love and hopefully purchase. If you found this video helpful make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. You can also connect with me on my social media. I have Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. I'm gonna link everything in the description box below for you. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great day no matter where you are in the world. Stay beautiful and I will see you soon. <laughs> Bye guys.